I think um, for in my career it's now uh, uh, the good time to make a step to to a nice club, and I think I really make a good transition uh, to this uh, amazing club. Uh, I think I cannot explain uh, it. So uh, if I heard the stories eh, from the from the old players, uh, Edwin, our uh, old director, uh, Daily Blind, my old teammate. Yes, if I heard these stories, um, yes, I cannot wait uh, to play for the for the club. The night off, because Fabrizio Romano has come out and said, "Here we go, Van der Beek to Manchester United." And look, it's very exciting. I mean, it's another player that we, as a United stand community, have got our way with. We wanted Bruno for a long, long time. Uh, we've been talking about. Uh, Van der Beek for a long, long time. We've got two. We've got two, baby. We've got two players that we really want. This doesn't happen very often. You know what? These are fan service signings. Yes, but that's what I said. Uh, I know nobody from the team. So, yes, I really, really uh, looking forward to, to, to see them and to meet them and to play with them. Uh, the only one. Yes, I know that time. This year we play uh, Europe and we get the final and we play against uh, against you guys and yes that time uh, was not not the best game from us but to be in the final for Ajax is really special but if you come then in the final you want to win and I think that game we don't deserve to win and United was better uh, that uh, that day and yes we were really disappointing but yes okay this is football and uh, yeah it's happened. tell me a lot of stories about the club about about everything and yes they tell me how big uh, the club is and how how nice uh, experience they have with it yeah really really big history and also like a club i always um, uh, watch the games from them a lot before and uh, i'm also uh, at a really good uh, meeting with with the coach and uh, yeah this was for me the also a really important thing and uh, we talk about uh, football things, about the club, and I always make decisions uh, about my feeling, and, and my feeling was directly with, good with it. So yeah, that was for me uh, important, uh, important thing. I think uh, if you know me, uh, kind of football player, I, I think uh, about my style, everything uh, that I'm can have a good combination with the club and players also. If you watch the players, uh, they have young players, the same age like me, and and I really, I really, I cannot wait to play with them. So I was watching a lot to them because yeah, yes, uh, so much good. Also in uh, in the midfield, a lot of good players, and yes, I can't wait to play with them. So uh, really, really nice, and yes, it, I enjoy with this uh, kind of football. Let's that one go. Good to see Donny back. His season was ended in, in January. He has it straight away, Donny. He plays the ball just slightly, but Dan Gore. Great ball in Van der Beek. Oh, it's a beauty. Great ball in from Dan Gore from the right hand side. And think about Dan Gore. That is absolutely phenomenal himself in. Running out of room, under pressure, but to pick out Beek, just guided it. Okay, for either side. Yeah, good ball in and yeah, no save in that. Lovely finish from the Dutchman. A shout of relief there. Nice if he score a goal as well, <laughs> yeah. but that's no, uh, not the most important thing. That's an extra thing, but it just, yeah, it's just uh, amazing, you know, to, to because I was looking forward months for this moment, you know. It, I know it's just a friendly game, but uh, for me it's a big moment. Easy. No, 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 just, um, yeah, you could do it also, just blind and kick the ball hard, but um, I just try to uh, to try to, to put it in a corner, you know, and then it doesn't have to be that f uh, fast, it just it has to be in the corner, so. Concentrate on your connection and yeah, making course, sure yeah, that's yeah, right, yeah. yeah. Um, and Simba, you were saying that for Donny to get back on the pitch, a huge thing. It is, obviously, we've all, we've all been there with your position, it's difficult to be. Um, to be out for so long, uh, we saw the, the relief in your face and how yeah. happy he was. We, you know, we all felt that. Um, but for everyone back at home, I think it's just—is that the type of goal that you want to be seen for, for scoring for Man United in that kind of position, coming late into the box? Because I feel like that's something that is your game. We just need to see more of it. True. Yeah. I mean, that's my uh, probably if you're going to watch in the past 
Yeah, that's the way how I scored my goals in the past, like uh, the cutbacks and then shoot it inside the box to, uh, with my inside uh, feet. So uh, yeah, yeah, but uh, yeah, it, I like it was a big moment for me. So uh, yeah, you know, if you if some people has experience with this kind of injuries and yeah, you can remember the moment, you know, when you come back after surgery and you come in the room and then you are so far away of this moment. So yeah, that makes it like a massive moment, Perfect. even if it's a friendly game. Absolutely, and. and Others, you've um, had injuries yourself and know what it's like to rehabilitate and get back onto that pitch. No, without a doubt, and just obviously a really challenging time being out for so long. And do you feel it's given you the opportunity to to also refocus in terms of coming back? It's, it's, I know being injured the first few weeks are awful, terrible, mentally really hard, but after that, the opportunity to really build up and to go again. Yeah, yeah, of course. It's easy to say, but I think the end of the way it makes you mentally stronger. Because you're realizing when you play every day and you don't want this, this kind of moment happen. But if it happens, you realize yeah, how love you much playing football. So yeah. if the moment coming there that you are back on the pitch and you more enjoy it, you know, and um, yeah. Uh, but of course you have to work really hard. And the moments when all the guys are uh, yeah, going to the gym, do their prep and they go outside. And I stay just with, the, with yeah. our official John. Uh, yeah, I work with him a uh, long time and uh, yeah, uh, we uh, we work really hard. So yeah, that, that's our hard moment, mentally strong ones. That's brilliant. Today it's just a friendly game, but if you see how many fans uh, are here uh, in the stadium, it's I, I don't think it's some. I think it's just here in United that happened. You know, uh, I can remember like in the past, you know, you just play for a few thousand people and like a friendly game, but. Like today, it looks like uh, a Champions League game or something. <laughs> so many people are here, so that's like, yeah, it's, uh, it doesn't feel like a friendly game. Yes, yes, I play a lot uh, in the uh, Champions League, Europa League with, with Ajax, and uh, we, um, I take that a lot of experience. And yeah, if you play this kind of games, you will improve like a football player. This was a really difficult time because as a football player, you know, yeah, okay, training, but you want to play games, then this is the most, this is the best thing for, for a football player that you play uh, matches. And that was too, uh, too long for me because, and um, yeah, what you say, for me, I really want to play uh, official uh, games. And uh, yes, I cannot wait. I cannot wait uh, to play for the for the club.